Hello and welcome back to Age of Empires 3 Tips and Tricks with me, Interjection. Today's video will be about the ranged damage which your town centre can do when settlers are garrisoned in it. When no settlers are garrisoned in your town centre, obviously it does not do any damage, but the moment you put one settler in, you can see it has a ranged attack of 9. If I then put a second settler in, this increases by 9 again. If I put a third settler in, this increases by 9 more. And this continues to increase by 9 for each settler you put in. However, there is a maximum of 10 settlers which you can have in the town centre to increase its damage to 90. Any more settlers you put in the town centre after that, such as this 11th settler, the attack damage will not increase. I'm playing the Asian Dynasty so you can see this in action, but on the vanilla Age of Empires 3, the town centre still works in exactly the same way, except you can't see the attack go up with each settler you put in, but believe me it does, even if it doesn't say. So with all this in mind, when you're being attacked, it's best to try to have just 10 settlers in your town centre in order to maximise the damage it can do. Though if you can help it, you don't want to have any more than 10 in the town centre, since that's a waste, and any extra settlers could be gathering resources. The final thing to think about when maximising efficiency is to consider how much damage it takes to kill an enemy unit. For example, a pikeman has 120 hit points and does not resist any ranged damage, so a town centre dealing 90 damage would take 2 shots to kill a pikeman but two shots is 180 damage. A pikeman only has 120 hit points. So the most efficient way to kill a pikeman with two town center shots is to have seven settlers garrisoned in the town center. That way you can have three more units gathering and the pikeman still goes down in the same time. A crossbowman will also take two shots with seven settlers garrisoned. A musketeer will take two shots with nine settlers garrisoned and a hussar will take three shots with 10 settlers garrisoned. To work this out for other units, you'll have to see how many hit points the unit has what ranged resist it has, and take into account the fact that the town centre has a 1.5 times multiplier versus cavalry. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video or found it useful, then remember to rate it thumbs up. That really is appreciated. And you can use the annotations on screen if you find them helpful. Thank you once again, and I'll see you next time.